Slowly, slowly, bro. They're everywhere. You don't want to step on them. Are these ones good ones? Yes. Yeah, we're going to go near. Oh, I see something over here, Fawn. And now they're poisonous. Oh, they're poisonous. <laughs> this one, it's um, not a good one. And can you uh, touch this one? This one you could touch, right? The other no, one, not so much. No, no. Okay, I won't if you tell me not to. So let's discover. <laughs> okay. Let's see if that's a good one. Right? Yes. Wait, let's see. How do you know it's good? And there, it's yellow, and you see it's kind of like, you know the green stuff that you find? It Moss? Makes, but in yellow, and if you touch here, it's very soft. It's slippery. Did you find another one here? There you go. Bravo. Là, t'as attrapé le pire. Il a bien pour, il est long. We have enough mushrooms to feed uh, the whole city. <laughs> on, a, on, a, on a plus de girons que de Be careful. We have a lot of space outside, and we love to be outside. So you don't need a, a lot. So this one is born because we don't have a TV, we don't have a computer, we just have our books. phone, and the rest is books and, and games and yeah, uh, yeah, yeah. talking and listening really music. <laughs> so I wanted him to have his main cave. Yeah. So funny. But what, I mean, it's the, the truck, it's like, yeah. yes. This is a horse truck. And it's not street legal, but it is uh, good here. <laughs> right, this would be tough to drive away. It can move. If everything can move. You but can move. you can't go under bridges. <laughs> you can't go under bridges. And, and all this underneath is like part of the original. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. We kept the, the, the horse trailer, the green party. So we're actually using, because we like to recycle, cost effective wise, the frame and the weight is the, the green metal, it uh, was part of the horse trailer. And we use that to go up to the next level. Goes up how high? Um, it goes up to the first level. It does, that's yeah. high. Yeah, okay. and then when you come inside, the, the main thing that holds everything together What's is a big beam. So this beam, you it's were saying that beam goes up from? Holding everything. I mean, this is, this is the... It's going from the top this is, to uh, the bottom. This is everything. This holds all the yeah, roof. Yeah. The, I mean, the magic happens yeah. here and here. But I mean, this feels really big. It doesn't feel like a tiny house on a truck or something. I mean, this feels like a cabin. It is. Yeah, it's it is. Uh, 32 meters square. This so one. that's uh, 350, 360 square feet. So we use the space under the that's steps to have storage. And this is a living room. Couch right. made of what? Uh, pallets. Pallets. And you really just got some old pallets. Yep. Absolutely. This yeah. is obviously electrical, the, the electrical oh. wire wheel. Uh, same thing outside. I love the idea of keeping the front of the truck here. We could have made for more storage, but I, I wanted people to know this was a truck. Like in a bus. Let's go on adventure. Let's go. A love adventure. Love adventure. Uh -uh. If you want to start it up, you could. Yeah, we can move it. Yeah. Part of the attraction of us for tiny homes is the fact that nothing is permanent. Close the window. Yeah, it's going to rain. I like the idea that maybe it could be moved. Obviously, it's quite tall. It's quite tall. Yes, it yeah. is. I can move it to another area on the property. We call this property an aerial, Landé. It's typical in the land. Uh, you have usually one or two houses, uh, one wheel, wheel oh, and three, and one fireplace and they used to do the bread in it. So my mom passed away in 2009 and I decided to, I had to share this property with my brother. So I decided to buy his part, everything. And we decide to live on um, this little one, to rent the big one. None of these other uh, units were here. No, it was just a little one. We bought this part, 150 euro. It was an old farmer platform. At the beginning, it was a truck. So the dad of my daughter did all in wood. And here, it was where we, you were driving. And it was like that. And then he, he, you can't see it was a truck before. We try to use only local materials. We try to be in harmony with the forest. And it's why there is big openings. So you feel like you're outside when you're inside cozy and warm. 
So here we have the kitchen and you have all you need. Mm. Like you have a stove. Ah, so you put, you cover it when you're not using it. To yeah, so we can use it to put some stuff in it because every space needs to be minimized. And here you have a oven as well. And a huge fridge. <laughs> <laughs> it is huge. Yeah. <laughs> Not even needed. <laughs> yeah. And the freezer here. You try to get the most space you can, so you use the mm -hmm. walls and the louter. But I, yeah, like I like this piece that just hangs with part of the forest. <laughs> yeah. Oh yes, this one. Those. Yeah. yeah. That's a tree. It's a real tree from from here. Yeah, yeah, yeah. 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 It's great. We pick it up here. And here, uh, in Pandry, to hang your clothes. Ah, your clothes. Yeah. <laughs> Every little bit is... Uh, the shower, the you have the shower here. Yeah. I can go inside. Uh, yeah, if it. <laughs> so you have a shower and um, a sink. Like uh, everything we, you need in a real bathroom. Yeah, that's like... Um, it's with batteries. Yeah. Yeah. Just to... Up, up. Great. So this is... a room of my daughter. She stayed here from 18 months to six years old. It sort of disappeared down in there. I mean, tiny. Yes. It is a room. I'm your standing. This right? is a room. Yes, yeah. it was a room of my daughter. It's like a little cabin. She was so cool here. She used to sleep here until six. And then she yeah. was just too big. She was touching here. <laughs> so we moved here. You can undo and you can uh, tidy up stuff. Storage. Mm -hmm. You have storage here and as well here. It's important to maximize every space. This is where we used to sleep. <laughs> yeah. So you had to crawl up at night and go okay. down when she calls me and uh, come back up. And my wife pees like five times a night. For real, at night, I had a pot, a baby pot, yep. into the shower and I was peeing inside. And in the morning, I was going out to uh, empty it. Yeah, because we never had a toilet when we were living. We didn't living. have a dry toilet for years. We did it when we started to rent it. Yeah, we would just go in the forest. And she had one <laughs> gastro. Stomach blue. Okay. Yeah, we were so lucky. So it's, it didn't feel claustrophobic? No, no. and we have a big window again. Yeah. With a view on the trees. I mean, you don't have yeah. much of an opening. So. It's like a boat. So there's a time in your life when this would work, when you have a very small child and it's just yeah. a couple up top. Exactly. And that works. But then you have to, you had to move. You have to keep then moving. she was getting bigger and we needed to extend the house as she was uh, extending herself. Yeah. But, uh, we found the solution. We have a lot of space outside, so we moved to the next house. And we decided to rent this one. To live here attracts a certain kind of people because it's uh, in the middle of the forest and it's super atypical. So we have a dentist living here. She works in Bordeaux, but she doesn't want to live in a big city. She goes to Bordeaux twice a week. She decided to live away from the city and be in a wild nest. Et je voulais vraiment que ce, cette propriété, ça devienne un lieu d'échange, de rencontre et de partage. La tiny house, bah, il faut s'adapter au fur et à mesure que, que la famille change et grandit. So after this one, we rebuild the little one to have more space. Yep. So we just came from 18 meters square to 43 40 meters, meters square. square. So. so this is a palace. <laughs> And we decided to rent so. this one. Then we are on a Compostelle path. So I wanted to have a bus yeah. to welcome the walkers. We paid her dad to do it. And on the way, He's when he was talented. doing JC this one, super he was supposed to buy a house and it took longer than, than he planned. Yeah. So they ask us to live in it. Yeah. So they lived that, that was cool. one year and three months. 
<laughs> so her dad, the stepmom, the little sister, yeah, and her. Sister. So she was one week here, one week with us, one yeah, week yeah. here, one week with us. So we kept the original windows because I want to keep the, the fact it's a bus and keep it original. So when you're inside, you can forget that it was a bus. <laughs> but uh, with the windows and you still have the writing, like when you're on a bus, the um, emergency. <laughs> so where did the bus come from? I used to work in a um, canoe place. We were bringing the people to the riverside with this bus. And at the end of the season, it needed to be changed. And they knew I wanted a, for a Compostelle walkers. So they offered me the bus. So you got a free bus. I mean, that's a great start. Yeah. Yeah. yeah, 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 yeah. So we kept the shape of the bus. We put isolation. Insulation. Yeah. Yes. And then a cover of wood. We had to do something with the floor because it was high. So when we put off all the seats, we realized it was high and in the middle was an alley, smaller. But when you're on the side, for me it's good, but for a men or woman higher than me, you can't cook and being like that and you can't take a shower. So we decide to keep this part low so you can access to everything without being uh, too crowded and, and <laughs> so this is a pretty regular kitchen I yeah that it's house. a house fridge so you have fridge and you have a freezer here and sink is regular as well it doesn't yes it all small no, no no everything yes the oven as well is <laughs> yeah. regular but actually there's quite a lot of sleeping space right mm -hmm. yes yeah, here you have two beds and under and there's space in it. Yeah, you have a lot of space to tidy up and here's the same and then you have the big bed over there. So it's four people. So here, as we have not so much space, we had to use the same door for the toilet and for the bathroom. So you can only have privacy in one spot at once. Yeah. <laughs> but that's also a part of it, because in a big house, when you have toilet and bathroom, and everyone can do everything at the same time, and everyone does his own stuff. Here, you need to ad adapt and adjust. So, okay, I'm going to the toilet. Can you wait a minute before you take your shower? You take more in consideration the others. Or you, if you need more intimacy, someone needs to go outside. And, and as you have less of space, if you cook and someone wants to go, behind, you need to communicate. <laughs> You can open. That come from the bus, it's original. And we had the same here, but we decided to put that for more light. Skylight. Actually, you see the trees yes. dropping. <laughs> in. <laughs> and the wood is all local? Yes. Yeah. Wasn't the original Le Land, exactly. Napoleon? Wasn't Napoleon decide to make it an industry tree farm? But there's a lot of tree farming in the area. Yes. My family got uh, 300 uh, hectares yeah. and they grow trees and sell the wood and grow again and sell the wood. And... There's something nice about small homes inside a forest. It's very fairy tale like. Yes, in a way. and it's reminds you that we are here, but we are in the, in the forest, like we are squatting. <laughs> Or like when we have spiders inside, or ladybugs, or we are in their environment. It goes to the other side. So this is for sort of deep storage. Yes, exactly. Yeah. So when this bus was for the canoe, we were putting the paddles under. Yeah, we have the gas bottle for the kitchen. So. So it's really still a bus. Yeah, yeah. yeah. It can no. move. It can move. It, it, it came here driving. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, all, yeah. It, all the things on wheels can be moved. We yeah. were here for two months. It's all wooden there. This was a camper? Or? Yeah. This one yeah. is tiny. Just a bed. We yeah, two yeah. months in it. So I put some more uh, storage. And some more lights. So you lived here? 
Yeah. Two months. So why here? What was the? I was uh, panicking financially, and I rented my house. So you wanted to rent a house. I don't want it. So I said, okay, we're gonna do it. It's super expensive. <laughs> yeah, and the people people paid. We had some bookings, and I said, oh uh oh, we need a plan B for us. Yeah, she didn't think people would book, but they did. They did. So we found this one, and yeah. we put it here, so you have a outside space. So you put indoor furniture out here, actually. Yes. So that belongs to my grandma, and when I moved her from her house to a fox home, I bring it this here. The sewing machine. Wow. As well. So you, here you're really using the outdoors. Your yes. whole kitchen living room the is. Shower's right here. <laughs> so you look at the pump shower right there. We need a puppet. So you're pumping water, and then you take your shower. And take your shower. It's great in the summer. But you also can boil the water, yeah. put it in, and take a hot shower outside. So it's just a camping thing. Yeah. The hearse is like that here because there is some pipes. So all the electricity comes from the house to the fireplace. And then you have change to go to every unit. We did the same with water. So that was an expense. Yeah. So here you have the electricity, this is one for the wood trailer, the bus, the main cave, and from here. Yeah. So we know exactly what people use as electricity. Right. So when they rent monthly, uh, every month, I calculate okay. and they pay just what they used. Yep. It's like a community yeah. with all the people living here. So this is the big house where my mom used to live and right now we are renting it a year long and we would love to renew it. But you don't live in it because it's bigger than yours so you yes. could have a bigger house but you'd prefer yes. uh, what you have. So as you can see the windows, Arle, the windows are really small and I need to see the forest <laughs> and big opening. You got so many. You got so many mushrooms. It's cool. We wanted to save the water. So when it's raining, the water goes here. It's a water tank. And then we open the tap and we use the water to wash our hands, to water the plant. We could drink it if we were putting plants here to filter the water. It's not like your traditional big plastic ugly water tanks. No, <laughs> I don't want it that. <laughs> I'm super conscious about decoration and visual, and I want it to be here without grabbing the attention. <laughs> this is where we moved when my daughter was too big. <laughs> and this was originally here, like yeah. this? Yes. It was beat up and old. This is the old way of doing it. This one is original and those two as well. But this one is new and the one who cross are new. We have two rooms, two bedrooms. So this is my daughter's room. She, when we moved here, she was starting the big school, so she needed the, a desk for homework. <laughs> Sometimes when I'm tired, I don't want to climb in. You mean I carry you up? <laughs> no, before! She uh, never fell. <laughs> I'll, I'll carry you all yeah. <laughs> Oh, now it's a big bed. It's yes, so she went from the tiny bed yeah. to a big bed. Sometimes when I play hide and seek in the house, I come hide in here. <laughs> so here it's her closet. She used to have clothes everywhere. So she did amazing and reduced. So now her brother is going to have a all this stuff here, and the idea is to cut in the middle and to put the bed here. This is a bench where you can tidy up stuff, and it's on wheel. So we're going to move it here, and then we can put the bed here. Right. So it's going to be cozy and comfy. All the books going to go up because she has space on her bed, top, and then we can tidy up the clothes. Yeah. Oh, so you could use that for clothes, the bookshelf? Yeah. This is our room and I made a little area for baby for the first month. So we decide to have big windows and just a bed in a room. Yeah. Here we have our closet. 
And here we have the bathroom. Oh god, this feels big now. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> and bright. <laughs> and a real toilet. But the first time we moved in, Pran didn't know what to do with the paper. Yeah. She said, uh, should I put it in a trash or can I put it inside? And I said, uh, no, no, it's a real one. <laughs> you can put inside. Yeah. We have the trash yeah. here. And that's easier, down kind of there. Yeah, oh. and we save space. We tried Usually it. trash right. goes under, but right. here we have... Oh, so using that corner space. Yes. Yeah. The and then we use uh, the ah. height. Yeah. I love this rounded. Yeah, device, so that's yeah? the end of this of table. Counter. counter, yeah. That you cut. Yeah, it's cut, like. Uh, it's and then reuse it. Et ça, c'est un plateau okay. que j'ai mis sur, uh, sur des pieds. Tu as fait ça? Oui. <laughs> this table, I hate it. I'm yeah. going to change it. Like but yeah. it's super convenient yeah. because you can tidy yeah. up stuff. Yeah. As we don't have a lot of space, it's convenient. Yeah. Yeah. But I am thinking of creating another table because. It's not wood and I don't like it. It's functional. It's functional. Yeah. You want to pick these? I think I don't know if those are good. Do you think those are good? They look good, huh? Let's go. People say, you're so lucky. It's a choice. We create it. This compound is about building it around what your needs. Exactly. Yeah. This worked when you had a small child. It wouldn't work now. I mean, anything's possible, but functionally... But, uh, <laughs> yeah. This is too small now, so you've had to move on. Yes. Yeah. Yeah. So in a way, it's a little bit like a snail. <laughs> I think you so. Your, right? I think so. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah. <laughs> we choose we to live, live in a way simple. and keep building and using it to have passive streams of income coming in, not wasting our money on huge, giant, ridiculous house, Whoa. huge, giant, ridiculous cars. We could already live in a big house, but then we rather live in a small space yep. and simplest. Lots of mushrooms. Take some, man. Yeah, really. <laughs> en bourgeoise. We, we start at eight, 18 meters square, now 43 meters square. <laughs> en bourgeoise.